Hey guys, welcome back to another box video and today I'll be unboxing Goku Black Rose from the Master Life series um, created by the Ichibancho figures. I was so excited to receive this. I actually got this um, from my dad as a birthday gift. So shout out to him for buying this for me. I was going to buy it anyway, but he beat me to it. So uh, yeah, I wouldn't have this video without him um, this soon. And I'm so glad I have this one. This one looks really sick. I haven't seen any reviews about it, any pictures of him out the box. So hopefully um, he's as expected as shown in the, the image, the cover photo of the box. So from the weight, he's not as heavy as you would think because of how big the box is. Um, usually, I feel like it's usually like that for the Master Lice figures. So without further ado, I'll showcase the box for you guys and then unbox it and give you guys my review about it. And there we go, we have Goku Black Rose or Black Goku Rose. And the best from my scene of him so far, this one is outstanding. I love the way it is. You can see the time ring on his right hand, as well as the Potari earring. It really it's really weird the way it's facing out like that. Um, I don't really like that as much. I've usually thought it'd be just um just straightforward, but straight down. But it's probably because of the way they manufactured it. They couldn't really, I'm assuming they couldn't make it go that close during the process. But him, Black Goku, with his um, black and gray gi, amazing to see. Love the way Goku came out. One of the best villains, personally to me. He's one of my favorite villains. Love the way he is. Just a great master lies. Love the figures that come out with them. I'm gonna give you guys a quick closer look. Here we go. From toe to head, and head to toe. We have the time ring I was mentioning earlier. The details we put into it. Goku Black's face. I think it came out pretty good, the expression and menacing look. This his whole god form is just pretty cool. The details I had in the hair, this little lining. Give it a quick twirl. The back of his head. Just a tiny detail. You know, the back, his waist. The stand as well. Let's get a quick back look with that time ring right here. All that detail, just that tiny, tiny detail makes it just the best. Personally, one of my favorite Goku Black figures as of right now. And 
there we are. I'm sure you guys are wondering where um actually my dad got it from, where we got it from. I actually got it off the sites I've been mentioning and the description in my previous videos. Um we got off Mary Carey. But um if you don't want to get it right now, I got mine for I think my dad got mine for 65 plus tax and shipping. But um GameStop is actually releasing it. They're on pre-order at GameStop right now for I believe 45 bucks pre-order. Um ship date's supposed to be um the 12th of this month, so the 12th of February, which is pretty close by. Um, if you guys want to go ahead and grab it. There's also a Gogeta that came out with this. Yeah, enough of that. Let me guys give you guys a quick 360. This one came out really good. The next Black Goku I'm actually excited for is the GX Materia. Or my, uh, my thing, I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. Um, I previously unboxed a Goku for you guys. GX Materia Goku doing the Kamehameha, which is pretty sick. And then I want to get that Gotenks as well with the Ghost pretty cool too but yeah this black goku you guys see his his gi going up it's like a of a battle it's pretty cool to see all those details so glad i was able to get my hands on this and i believe this one stands about like nine inches tall i'll leave a correction if i'm wrong on the screen this is just one of the best figures out there for me right now or Goku Black. If anything, I'll give you guys a quick size comparison to some other figures. So I'll give you a size comparison to like Bardock from the Grandista line, which is a pretty sick figure, if I do say so. So he doesn't have the stand, he does have the stand with it, but I usually like them standing up by themselves. So this Bardock actually sounds about 12 inches tall. So approximately this one's eight to nine inches, give or take. Pretty cool. I think this fares well with the Master Roshi from the Strong Change line. Let me, guys, let me give you guys a quick um, high comparison to that one, actually. Okay, so maybe not. Maybe maybe that wasn't such a good idea. Anyway, you guys get a good glimpse of how Big E is, at least compared to the Master Roshi from the Strong Change line. Um, another one I can compare it to as well. Plus, compare it to the trunks I previously unboxed as well. The future trunks. So, I also, for the trunks, I also don't put this down on him because he could stand up perfectly by himself here's a size comparison to him maybe not even an inch smaller half an inch smaller maybe to the goku black it's pretty cool pretty cool size for the goku black preferably he's like he's, he's that size because um of the way he's standing his dance his pose yeah here's a goku black rose pretty cool figure um i love the way he came out so I'll actually try leaving the link for the GameStop um, pre-order. And then I'll also um, just put down the names of the apps you could possibly get them from. Pretty sure eBay has it, but I feel like eBay goes more over the retail price. Um, so does Mercury too, but my dad thought it was best to give it to me sooner than later. Which I was fine with. But yeah guys, nonetheless, hope you guys enjoyed me unboxing this Goku Black Rose from the Master Lies. I think pretty cool i love this figure put it in, fit right in with my collection i can't wait for, to get that gogeta super saiyan blue for you guys that one looks pretty cool i um, hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to leave a like subscribe um i have more unboxing videos for you guys just like this this goku black just i can't get get out of my sight how amazing it is but yeah guys um i'll see you guys in the next video thank you guys for watching